The Presbyterian Church in America is a confessional Presbyterian denomination primarily present in the United States. It is the largest U.S. Presbyterian denomination that enforces adherence to the confessions, and the second largest Presbyterian denomination overall in the U.S. behind the Presbyterian Church USA, which is a mostly theologically liberal mainline denomination. The Bible is a 66-book canon, which is infallible and inerrant in the original manuscripts, and the subordinate standards are the Westminster Confession of Faith and the larger and shorter catechisms. The PCA affirms the Trinity, deity of Christ, his virgin birth, sinless life, miracles, literal death and resurrection, and that there is a future judgment day, literal heaven for the saved, and hell for the lost. There is a literal devil. There are two sacraments. First is baptism, primarily by sprinkling, though other modes are valid, and infant baptism is common, though previously unbaptized converts also are baptized. Baptism is a sign and seal of the covenant of grace, of engrafting into Christ, of regeneration, and of remission of sins. Those baptized as infants may make a public profession before First Communion, which the PCA recommends. The second sacrament is the Lord's Supper, in which Christ is viewed as spiritually present but not physically present, nor are the elements of communion transformed. The sacraments are means of grace and effectual means of salvation. Any baptized believer may participate in communion at a PCA church. PCA churches teach some form of creation, but the majority are not young earth creationists. Believing in evolution is an acceptable viewpoint in most PCA churches. The PCA affirms a human sin nature, and most in the PCA believe in a conversion experience or time of salvation. The PCA is five-point Calvinist, regeneration precedes faith, and total depravity, unconditional election, limited atonement, irresistible grace, and perseverance of the saints are affirmed. Entire sanctification, or a second work of grace sanctification experience, is not taught in the PCA, nor are they charismatic. The default position is cessationism, though not all pastors are cessationist. For cessationists, the miraculous spiritual gifts such as tongues are not available to believers today. The continuationists would still deny that the practices of the modern charismatic movement are legitimate. There is room for diversity on end times theology in the PCA. All millennialism, postmillennialism, and classic premillennialism all have a following. The theological framework is covenant theology, however, not dispensationalism. The PCA position is that homosexuality is sinful and that marriage is between a man and a woman. Marriage vows are to be kept until death. Sexual immorality is a reason for a justified divorce. Those divorced for biblically unjustified reasons should not remarry. Abortion is viewed as sinful. Worship style can vary from church to church. Some churches are modern and contemporary, others still use primarily the hymn book, and some churches offer both styles in separate services or blended worship. Alcohol is not prohibited. The church teaches that members should give at least a tithe of 10% of their income to the church. Currently, there is some controversy within the PCA regarding the matters of same-sex attraction and gay identity identity, as well as critical race theory. The polity is Presbyterian, with a session of elders in the church governing it. Over churches are presbyteries made up of pastors and church leaders. A general assembly meets as the highest authority of the church. The offices are elders and deacons, with elders being teaching or ruling. Women may not be ordained to the office of pastor or deacon. The PCA is a member of the National Association of Evangelicals, North American Presbyterian and Reformed Council, and World Reformed Fellowship. At its founding in 1973, there were 41,232 members in the PCA, and 260 churches. Today, there are 383,721 members and 1,915 churches. For more on the PCA, watch this video comparing the PCA to the Lutheran Church Missouri Synod and the Anglican Church in North America, or the full-length 25-minute video which provides more nuance on these positions. There's also this video that compares Presbyterians to Baptists. Subscribe to Ready to Harvest for more denomination videos. Like this video if you enjoyed it.